take any puppy outside on leash to any environment, say the city, are they going to give you immediate focused attention? Heck no. A leaf blowing in the wind, garbage on the ground, any smells that they might catch, anything is going to be more interesting than you. The environment is a great educator, but what is that puppy or dog learning? They're learning when they get into environment A, they ignore you. When they get into environment A, they look for other things to do. They look for other ways to get their entertainment, possibly to get their reinforcement. Chasing is a great reinforcement. Finding things to eat on the ground, that's a great reinforcement. It's the environment educating your dog. But that's not a good plan. If you want your dog to live their best life ever, and you want your dog to become the most amazing family companion that you ever dreamt of. So dog training needs to be intentionally from you, or it will be organically from the environment. It's like saying, would you take a 15 year old kid with a learner's permit to downtown New York city during rush hour to teach them to drive? Uh, no, that makes no sense at all, Susan. Of course it doesn't. Why? Because the stress factor for you and potentially for the new driver is going to be sky high because you're taking a massive risk of something unpredictable happening that could scar that new driver for life. Because the chances of that new driver losing confidence in their ability to even drive is so high. And the likelihood of you being so overwhelming to the, them trying to learn because of the high stakes of the environment, the relationship you have with that new learner is probably going to be crushed. Where do we take that new learner permit driver to learn how to drive? We go to an empty parking lot. We go where there's no distractions, where we can in a calm environment, let them know about the check your shoulder and where the brake and where the gas pedal is. That's a much less stressful environment to learn, right? And the same is true for your dog. We want our puppy or dogs to learn an environment that is free of stress, that is the most comfortable environment that they can be in that is free of distractions and is relaxing for both you and the dog. So you can be at your best selves. That isn't a brand new environment. So where can you go where your puppy will be most engaged with you, will have more focus for you, that won't be distracted by the environment, that is more likely to grow their confidence and more likely to learn the skill that you're teaching? Hmm. If only there was a place. Ding, ding, Eureka. It's your home. It's a place in your home. It's a place we like to call a training den, an environment where you'll just ward off a little corner of no matter how big or small your living area is a tiny little area where you will always go to train your dog so that they can grow confidence in this environment, that this is the place where they learn good things happen here. Games are played. Reinforcement is earned. That's where we teach our puppies. That's where you're going to have the most success. That's where uptake is going to be the highest. Games of reinforcement, games that build excitement, games that the dog or puppy loves to play because the games innately create focus for you. And we then transfer that focus to work. If you play these games for 10 consecutive days in a row, I know that you could take your puppy into a different environment and they would have focus for you. How do I know that for sure? Because just last week, I picked up a friend's puppy, a puppy I had never met before. I took that puppy outside. I tried to interact with the puppy, got zero interaction, took the puppy inside to a training den in my house, played games with that puppy for 10 minutes and then took that puppy back outside. And guess what? I had nothing but laser focus from a puppy that wasn't even three months old. I'd never met the puppy before. The total time she was with me was less than one hour, 45 minutes to be exact. Instantly, I got more focus for me. I didn't have to bribe. I didn't have to lure her with a cookie. She just had a transfer of value because of the games we played and it will happen for you as well. And if you did that consistently taking daily action, your mind will be blown at the difference you'll see in your puppy or your dog. And I know without a shadow of doubt, it will work for you. 